All right, other news now beginning tomorrow morning. State lawmakers will start dividing up nearly $2 billion in federal funding. There is, though, some disagreement over whether to also cut taxes during this special session. Barry Mangle joins us now with exactly where things stand. Barry? Yeah, Amanda, the original purpose of this special session is to allocate the billion-plus dollars in money from the American Rescue Plan Act, or ARPA. Governor State is also hoping to pass certain tax cuts. However, those ideas are already hitting a wall in the Senate. The bottom line, everything is more expensive, and Oklahomans are hurting. Governor Kevin Stitt Tuesday called on lawmakers to end the state's grocery tax, an idea that's been tossed around the legislature for years. The House came in and passed it just a couple weeks ago, and I'm confident that uh, the majority of people behind me in this building want to get it done. Republican leadership in the Senate immediately signaled that any bill to end the grocery tax won't make it far. Senate pro tem Greg Treat says it's not the right time, adding, quote, as we enter a recession, we must remember just a few short years ago, we were scrambling with a $1.3 billion shortfall. We must be mindful and do tax cuts the right way. Appreciate uh, the media coming out. On Wednesday, a group of Republicans called on their leadership to reverse course and cut the grocery tax. If we can be called in to dole out that money, we also could be called in to give actual relief to the people of Oklahoma. That money is more than a billion dollars in federal ARPA funds, and current proposals include putting millions toward new health care facilities at OU Children's, expanding broadband internet access, expanding health care services, and much more. And that group of Republicans also want to pass a statewide ban on gender transitioning procedures during this special session. I asked both House and Senate leadership if that could happen when debate starts tomorrow. Both declined to comment. Barry Mangold, Oklahoma Zone, News 9.